Lesson 154. Mass. Well, Bill, this new word, mass, you use it in Spanish the same way as you use it in English. So let's say, for example, in the first exercise, we want to say more water. We just say mas agua, just like that. Exactly the same. So no changes in structure or anything. So there's nothing complicated to talk about here, right? Nothing. Okay, let's look at these exercises. Mas agua means more water. Por favor means please. So more water, please. And number two, I means there is or there are. Mas comida means more food. In la cocina means in the kitchen. So number two says, there is more food in the kitchen. And number three, quiero mas huevos means I want more eggs. Por favor means please. So I want more eggs, please. In number four, we have a question. Por favor means please. Together, puedes and tú say, are you able? Cocinar means to cook, and mas huevos means more eggs. So number four will say, please, are you able to cook more eggs? Or, please, can you cook more eggs? In number five, la comida de tu madre means your mother's food. The verb is encanta. Nos means to us, and a nosotros also means to us. So number five literally might say, your mother's food is enchanting to us, to us. But what it really means is, we love your mother's food. In number six, we're addressing multiple people. Ustedes necesitan means y'all need. Leer means to read. And mas libros means more books. So y'all need to read more books. In number seven, mi hermano necesita means my brother needs. Beber is an infinitive that means to drink. And mas agua means more water. So number seven says, my brother needs to drink more water. In number eight, el gato está means the cat is. En la cocina means in the kitchen. E means and. And then we have the verb está. The subject of that is also the cat, el gato. Durmiendo means sleeping. En la mesa means on the table. So number eight will say, the cat is in the kitchen and he is sleeping on the table. In number nine, the words yo and quiero together say, I want. We have an adverb in there, tambien, which means also. And almorzar means to have lunch. That's an infinitive. So number nine will say, I also want to have lunch. In number 10, mi madre está means my mother is. Haciendo means making or doing. La cena means dinner. Para mi padre means for my father. So number 10 will say, my mother is making dinner for my father.